No more. Nah, Asian. you said you kill white listen, domestic. I, bro. Listen, nigga, I grew up. Yeah, yeah, yeah exactly. Grew up that's what I'm white say. domestic. But yeah, this is what I'm okay. saying. I don't. Listen, what I'm saying. I'm, I got Mexican partners. Right, what right. I'm saying is, nigga, what I'm saying is, if we go fight against anybody, we need to fight a Mexican or a white boy first. They, and what I'm saying is, no more in nature. Hold on, let me finish. Let me finish. Let me finish. No more in nature. No more in nature do you see a red bird and a blue bird flying together. No more in nature. Okay. Nigga, so, everything so is My question is, are, are we included in this? Or are we, are we, man, a Mexican ain't got no bitch you speaking in here. We talking about nigga on nigga. Unless you, nah, you but nigga. nah, but you didn't say, say man. Well, then what I'm saying, homie, then what I'm saying, homie, do y'all bang against the Mexican gang because y'all fight that? Don't Mexican do big oh. niggas bad. Oh, no, nah, nah, don't, nah, don't, nah. don't, they say, don't Mexican, they ain't it some Mexican don't like nigga. Oh, it's a, it, of course, it's a lot of, so goddamn it, let's what? get with it then, nigga, race against race. Right. <laughs> it's some niggas nah. don't like Mexican, so what are y'all talking about, my nigga? It's a Mexican. Listen, listen, say, listen, listen. I'm, I, it's I'm a Mexican. Listen, homie, it's a Mexican. If they get a chance, they'll kill a nigga. They in prison. So come on, homie. That's what you talking about, S.A. This ain't your conversation. It, this it, nigga it, talk, S.A. As soon as you, and listen, as soon as you, I would much rather say this, homie. I come up in the area where niggas fought Mexicans, niggas fought white boys, niggas fought Mexicans and whites. Nobody joined in to fight nigga on this. So what the I'm Mexican and white you, boys joined in to fight us. But so we don't let I'm nobody at. join in to help us. We what die losing before we let anybody else join in to help us. The North, the North help I don't know nothing about that. Homie. All I know is dripping blood. I don't know nothing about North Daniels. But, but, but my, my question is... Man, is you taking me somewhere. I don't know nothing about the West Are we going to cut? You got to know about this. This is just speaking as a human. They just speaking nigga, 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 Pisces over there, Mexican Americans <laughs> over there, Jews over there, nation against nation. Nigga, Dr. King tried that shit. It didn't work. No, no. Hey, hey, look. Hey, Charles, still look. I know you fucked up with me, though. Hold on, let me speak right quick. I'm not, I'm not here to bash you, but I'm here to talk about your contradiction. You ready, brother? So let's listen. This is where you're coming. Hold on, no, 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 no
It killed that mindset to go across the railroad track for much fun to get your own people. So, but you to ask your own people. Hold on, hold on, hold on. I just asked you a question. Big body. I, I, I just asked you a question, fam. So, to ask the question about Slim, I don't know the guy, never heard his music, never knew who existed. I was asked the question about the guy. Is he a gang member? Yeah, a gang member. Fuck him. That's any gang member, homie, not just your homie. Any gang member. I believe when gang members die in that manner. Hey, but this is fucked we, up at with me. That was a man first. Uh, so I don't know that. I, 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 Nigga, fuck that rapping nigga, homie. That, that's what the, that's what he give off. So if this rapper killer give off this image as he's a killer, we supposed to have empathy for him? He done gave off this image. So when do we cry when the gangsters die? The Italians don't do it. The mafia, the cartel members don't do it. So what the fuck are these black gang members crying at funerals for? Nigga, it come with the life. You singing it, you rapping about it, you living it, you promote it, you embrace it, you encourage it. You reaping what you have sown, Slim, and it cost Vincent his life. See, we all got a dual nature, homie, that we fight against. They call them demons. You know what you do in the dark. They don't nobody know what you do, but you God and the devil. We all got to pay, homie. And the sad thing and so about you me, was a part of a gang once yourself, right? Homie, homie, I listen, you, you keep missing the point. I joined as a kid inside of an institution. It don't matter if you're a kid or not. Listen, homie, listen, 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 listen. Don't say, matter what I never, I never, listen, homie, I never, listen, homie, I never, listen, homie, we was having one on one fights. We wasn't kidding nobody. And we, listen, homie, listen, 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 Hold on a second. Slim 400 did not die gang banging. That was not a gang banging. Straight up, nigga, what? That killed you. Nah, but yo, 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 Gavin, you gonna ask a question, ask a question, bro. Let's not No, I'm not bashing him. I'm just asking a question. No, but I'm just saying that's not turning into a shallow match because we got other people that want to ask questions. Hey, listen, for the the record, Slim 400 did not die gang banging. He was a cop in Paru. A cop in Crip didn't kill him. That was some personal shit going on. If you do your research, you got killed at his baby mama house. You do your research who the other individual is, you'll see that's some family type orientated shit going on. Dude didn't come kill Slim because Slim shot at him. He was a cripple, he had blood. So Slim did not die gangbang. Just to clarify that. He didn't die in his neighborhood. He didn't die in the other dude's neighborhood. None of that. So, you know, me, I know Slim. Slim really fuck with everybody. If you go to Instagram, you see cop and crips. You see all kind of crips putting up pictures of Slim. You see bloods, bar rules. You see you know, regular people, comedians, actors, everybody that knew him. Dude, had a, dude was a real, you know, no charismatic dude. So he didn't die gang banging, homie, just for the record. No, no, I got a quick question, if I may. Thank you for clearing that up, big bro. I got a quick question. Yo, yo. That is that, that. Yeah, I just want to know, like, Charleston, like, the way you coming off, your delivery and everything, I hear what you're saying, but is you ready to put on, like, you, you rubbing motherfuckers the wrong way, like, if shit don't go your way when you run into somebody, how you gonna handle that? He tell it. He already told you what he go do if he can't shoot you. He goes. Get your mic. Get your mic button, Johnson. Unmute your mic. <laughs> we already told the nigga what he gonna do. Nah, you can't be saying fuck somebody and then saying you calling the goddamn police, nigga. He already said it. If he can't kill you first, you tell him. 
Oh, you better have yeah, a no, thirteen no, mask on, nigga. You ain't never mm-hmm. met these men a day in your life. Why would you say fuck these niggas and rest the rest of this? He though? say fuck mm-hmm. all gay niggas. That's that's his movement. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's, yeah, yeah. that's business oh, movement. It, it's easy. It's just like he the said, average. I'm a gay member. He said fuck me. I'm a, you know. Oh, uh, uh, but listen, homie, listen. Hey, listen, homie. It's 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 easy to say fuck a nigga because we all say fuck a nigga when we don't know a nigga. We all say that. We all say let let let, let we, we all we, can, we all say fuck a nigga when we don't know a nigga. But let me ask you a question, fam. I travel around the country with no security and no gun, my nigga. So I got to be willing to stand on it, homie. And I go to niggas' hoods. I go. I'm out in public events, so I got to be willing to stand on it, homie. If I'm out in public. I got to I got to know what what comes yeah, with nah, uh, with this with you this. You got dead yeah. no blood no foul. You ain't around no real niggas doing this shit, bro. Yeah, you can't no stay on me. Hey homie, hey hey homie, hey listen. Say hey listen, homie, hey listen, hey listen. Say homie, listen, listen, hey listen. Say this, homie. When I'm in the airport, hey listen. When 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 I when I'm in the club and the bar, it's real niggas suffer. When when I was in, I told the mob is facing Melvin face. They didn't do nothing. They had already heard me say what they said I can't say. Dope senior citizen. I wouldn't give a damn. Yo, who else got a question? Anybody else? I wouldn't give a damn. Hey, 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 what's going on? One thing I know, homie, listen. One thing I know, the average nigga don't have bond money. The average nigga don't have lawyer money. Nigga, it's the enemy in the eye that he can throw his life away for who killed his homie. They ain't throwing hey, away from it. But Nipsey and Nipsey and Bro. Man, ain't no ain't no ain't nobody broke into the jail. Ain't nobody, ain't nobody broke, ain't nobody broke in jail. Ain't nobody broke in jail to kill the nigga that killed him. That what they got. Ain't nobody broke in jail to kill the nigga that killed him. All these Say homie, listen, listen, hey homie. Say homie. Ain't nobody broke in jail to kill the nigga that killed him. Didn't nobody jump in front of the bullet like they do the president. Nigga, when that nigga fired them shots, everybody took off running. This nigga crazy. You crazy as shit. See, nigga, the president, the president, nigga, got people. Say, homie, say, homie, let me tell you something, nigga. When, 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 uh, uh what's that mother, El Chapo Jr.? Nigga, he got arrested in a Mexican tank by the Mexican army. All these people came and shouted out with the Mexican army and made them motherfucker release him. Until you niggas get bad like them niggas, man, be quiet. Ain't no nigga put, ain't no nigga got to that nigga in jail to kill them. Ain't no nigga pausing them. None of that, homie. They don't even talk about it. They don't even condemn it. Nigga, how y'all let the stove close if you love him so much? How y'all let the stove close, nigga? Get a fat burger, nigga. Show us. Don't tell us. Yo, you can't nigga, still ain't yeah, you nigga paint it down, nigga paint the pictures on the wall, nigga. Uh, ain't no more marathon t shirts. Still, you still ain't proving no point by saying no. I ain't trying to prove no point, homie. Like, I'm not trying to prove no point. Like, we have dialogue. My question is you, is, you talking to you just no. so is you talking serious or is you playing right now? Oh, uh, nigga, what you mean am I talking serious or am I playing? You just told me you were a character. That. You told me you was a character, so I don't so know. Why you asking then? Why you asking then, nigga? Then why you asking then, nigga? Yeah, why you asking then, nigga? Yeah, fool ass nigga, what you asking for? I done already told you. We're gonna get some new people up. Hey, yo, Alamo, what you got to say, bro? Searching for confusion, man. Let the man speak. Yeah, this nigga standing out and I already told you. I'm in character. You gonna come back and try to get me out of character, huh? No, nigga, you can play it on, not me. Yo, Alamo, you had a question. Yo, Jay, you had a question. Which one of y'all who gonna go first? Nah, it's Alan Moore. I don't, I don't, I don't think he's saying nothing wrong. I think it's, I think everybody just got a problem with the delivery. But like they say, the truth hurt. And before you make a change, you're gonna have to get to that nerve. To any type of change to anybody, what he talking about. So you know what I mean. But it's disrespectful to, to a lot of people, and I feel you, because a lot of people is hurt behind that. That ain't got nothing to do with nothing. And I think that's what people keep fighting for more than anything. Hey, hey, we're right, well, we going on. This is my first time in Info Minds. Uh, uh, I was just chiming in to uh, actually talk to Charleston White a little bit and, you know, get a little perspective of how he coming. Um, I'm from Chicago. You know what I'm saying? So when he be talking about the things that he be talking about, sometimes it be true. Because, see, I'm not in a gang. I'm from an organization. So the Bloods and the Crips, yeah, they gang. They want to be the the, the 
gang bangers of America. They, they call themselves the gang bang capital of America. I don't agree with that. I let them have that. You understand what I'm saying? But as far as the things that he's saying, he's very correct. I'm from Chicago. I have never went against a white boy. Have never thought about uh, 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 shooting a white boy, but I can shoot a nigga though. You see how simple that is? You, you, it, it's just that simple. But the, the delivery that he's given it, 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 it is broad. It, it is we supposed to listen to it because it has a real message to it. It's a message that if we understand what he's talking about, it resonates with everybody on this platform. From gangbangers to people that want to be in the game to people that don't want to be in the game. See, that's why we own this platform. Uh, uh, we 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 we're trying to figure something out right now. We're not really worried about how he be talking about the Bloods and the Crips and Melvin and 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 Artola. It, it, that ain't what we our mission is. Our mission is, like he said, is to breach our youth. Our youth is being breached by social media, Lil Nas X, everything under the, the sun that we can't really reach them to teach them because we losing them by all this bullshit that we idolizing, like he's saying, these characters. I didn't get up on the Crips until I read Monster Cody book. Now, I was fascinated by the Bloods and the Crips from South Central Cartel in 1988. I, I used to dress like them. I used to wear uh, Chuck Taylors and khaki suits. I just didn't wear the bandanas because I wasn't a crib. So I understand exactly what he's saying. It, 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 it is, it, it is um, how can I try to put it? Because it, it, my mind racing real fast because I know everybody trying to say something. But it, 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 he telling the honest truth of what's going on with us uh, as far as uh, the black culture. No, I don't like that culture word. When we say uh, culture, as far as this gangbang, that's not a culture. You understand what I'm saying? Like, we all know we have choices. That was a choice that I took. That was a choice that everybody took. That's not our culture. Uh, 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 this man said that uh, the blood, the crib, the GD, the vice lords, and all that is, is, is some type of tribe in a culture. That's not a tribe. That's not a culture. That's it, it, It's just something that... that, that bothers me with that. You understand what I'm saying? And and, and the reason I be so adamant about nations. He named nations. Those ain't tribes. Those are nations. Now, Ryder, what's your, what's your, uh, not my part of me, uh, but what's your question, though, my brother, so we can get to the, to, to the next person? What's your question, though, fam? Well, I, I, my, I, I didn't really have a question. I was just going to say more so that, you know, when he be talking about, you know, uh, the gang members, he not necessarily de denouncing them. You know, it is true. A lot of people that don't have no retirement. We knew this when we was 14. You wasn't going to get no pension. So so I don't see why everybody having this um, um, debate of why he, you know, uh, uh, I guess, you know, trying to shit on people. But he's not really telling the truth because I ain't got no pension. I'm 45 years old. You understand what I'm saying? So I'm just saying that what he's saying is he really kind of correct us what he's saying. There's no pension. There's no love when one of us die. It's two killers that just died in the neighborhood, and there's still no love today. I mean, but he's telling the truth, and that's, you know, basically what I want to say right now. Oh, uh, yo, Mike, we appreciate you, man. We appreciate you. Um, yo, Savvy, you had a question, right? What's your question, bro? Yes, sir. I appreciate you letting me up, uh, What's up, everybody on stage? Uh, I have a quick question for you, Charleston, uh, if you don't mind. Um, I fucked you heavy as far as your general uh, message is concerned and everything. Pretty much everything I've heard you say tonight is absolute facts. Uh, I was born in 96. I noticed that uh, my generation uh, simply don't like hearing the truth. Uh, for example, uh, there's a large part of, uh, in my generation, there's a large part of the black population who idolizes and even fetishizes black on black killings and black deaths in general. For example, let's be honest, it wasn't a white person or a Hispanic or an Asian person who killed King Vaughn or Nipsey Hussle. But yet, if I were to bring that fact up in general conversation amongst my peers in my age group, niggas would laugh, niggas would scoff, niggas would call me a Sharif. Basically, niggas would throw it aside like nothing, like the deaths uh, basically were meaningless. 
So it's definitely uh, becoming a cultural thing for sure. Uh, where my question comes in uh, for you is, I myself am not a street nigga. And like you, I despise the street niggas but those who are, are more street, bullies. Those are, street, those are streets. Those are street situations that you're speaking of that you couldn't understand then because you're not a street nigga. Yo, hold on, no, hold on, hold on. Like, let me finish. Let me finish. Let me finish. Let me finish. See, that's what's wrong with you niggas trying to think for another man. Let that man speak on what his perception is, bro. Yeah, because I'm being affected by the same shit. Everybody got dead niggas. Like, come on, bro. Like, come yeah, on. What, was your what was your question? What was your question? Hold on, because I was actually reading off another. He fucked me up. I got to get back to where I was. Uh, yeah. Uh, no, here, I here I am, here I am. Uh, I, like you, despise the street niggas who are more bullies in nature. Uh, I know I was born in 96, but I caught small glimpses of street niggas who still stood on, stand on integrity, morals, and respect. The street niggas who hustled and threw cookouts and fed the whole hood and made sure the whole hood was straight. Obviously, shit like that is no longer the norm. And, but clearly, street niggas are back on top, and it looked like they hit it. They hit a stay. Ultimately, uh, this leads to my question: uh, How much of the blame would you put on the OGs who were supposed to keep uh, us, meaning the younger generation, in control? And how much of the blame would you put towards niggas as being niggas? Uh, I would put no blame on the OGs, and I would put no blame on the niggas. Right? Uh, the OGs were never OGs in the beginning, homie. All the OGs have always been niggas that was getting high. That could fight and that would kill somebody. They didn't know how to teach nobody. They didn't know how to teach a nigga when you get the girl pregnant how to go to prenatal care. So it wasn't no instructions. It wasn't no teaching, homie. It ain't never been no structure with the Crips and the Bloods for the BD to listen to the OGs. You listen to the OGs, homie, because they was bullies. Not, not, not out of respect, homie. Come on, homie. That is true. Because if it wasn't true, if it wasn't true, the young niggas would be listening today. What about, what, about, what, about, what, about, what about what about what about the king of all kings, Jeff Ford, who changed his name to Chief Malik? You say who? Chief Malik. Man, Ford. I don't know nothing about them nigga. Who are that? I don't know him. Who, who, who is he? What he do? What gang he call? I don't that, know nothing about that, them. Nigga. That's the king of the Black Peace Stones. Man, I ain't never heard of them, nigga. We only know Crips and Blood. I mean, I don't know about no Black Peace Stones. It's some, it's some blood. We don't know this, homie. We don't know nothing about no peace stone, no gangsters. They didn't, they, we don't, they, they didn't, they didn't, they didn't, uh, uh, Hollywood us with those. Nigga, they gave I'm us peace yeah. yeah, I'm Yeah, they don't give us, they don't give us black peace stone, Michael Jordan. They give us blood and power and crimp, Michael Jordan. They didn't make songs about blood and peace stone. They made songs about Crips and Blood. Crips and Blood was commercialized. See, that's the yeah. point y'all missing. When, when yeah, Crimson Bloods yeah, originated, yeah, it, you know what I mean? I, I done heard so many. I done been with Baba Louie. I done been with Cappuccino. I done been with all the originals. I done heard them all about what they started, man. Fuck what it started. Look what it's still doing. In 72, they've been killing. Bro, but you said they had no structure. But it they ain't never had that structure. way, Charles. They ain't, but it ain't never had no structure yeah, when they were yeah, fighting. Yeah. Through. Man, listen. When <laughs> Raymond and Tookie and them met up in St. Andrews, this is my thing. This is my thing. And I'm going um, to pause the video because he made a valid point. He said he said that um, they've been killing since 1972. Do the math, y'all. Do the math, man. First of all, blacks are only 13% of the population. Whites, once again, I'm going to reinforce these numbers. Whites are 400 million compared to only 34 million blacks. So use, you, use the pie chart in your mind. That ain't even half a slice. That ain't even, that ain't even half of a half of a slice of pizza, bro. Now, with that in mind, if blacks, since the Black Panthers started their organization to protect the neighborhood from violent police officers and, and, and outsiders from uh, beating on the black people. And they, 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 they formed these gangs. And uh, the FBI, I forgot the dude's name, uh, the FBI uh, a leader, uh, was it a, a Hoover or something like that? I can't think of his name. But he put this agenda out there, like we're gonna give them gun, money, and gun, guns, 
money and drugs to, to poison a community. With that in mind, since all the killing has been happening, do the math. How much killing has been done since 1970 to, to, to current to present, 2021? Each state in, individually. 50 states in America, 200 murders per state of black people since 1970. Man, you got to be talking the Holocaust, man. You got to be talking about like 10 million black people. So, yeah, the, 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 the gang culture is almost the white people don't got to kill us, man, because we killing ourselves. That's over 10 million brothers in the cemetery, bro, since 1970. Just, take, just keep it in your mind. Boy, you wasn't no structure. It wasn't no structure. They were bullying people. Cookie was taking the sack lunches from the workers, remember? It wasn't no structure. LB, Pop Rules testified against LB. How was that structure? The mafia got structure. They don't have no treasury, no board of directors. How do they have structure when they can wage war at any given, any time? There's no structure. That's why it's a free for all. Boys following boys. No man have ever joined the game. And don't y'all ever forget that. It's always been a boy. Raymond Washington was a boy. He went to prison. And he went to prison. And he got to meet some men that told him, nigga, that ain't the way. And he came back with a black liberated mind. But took him and was already out of control with no structure, a bunch of bullies. That's why the bloods had to form. Everybody was bullying. Tell the whole story, brother. Yeah, the whack. You from the you West, whack. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. The whack from the West, you can attest to that. Attest to what? Attest to what? what? That what? About on the yeah. last that he made. That we was out, no? Nigga, no, nigga wax up. He's a mark, no, man. Wax one hundred's a mark. Give me your leather coat. Give me your leather coat. Nigga. This nigga won't act like they he know bullies. everything, man. I, mean, I don't like it, nigga. Wax, man. That didn't start over no dripping blood shit. That was some personal shit. Look and at him, bro. Just happened to be his family. He's a mark, man. On one side, and the other side happened to be for that. So that that wasn't like that. So the, crips, so, so the crips didn't take the steel jackets when niggas had leather coats. They like them. The stories I got from the original. They caused mayhem in the community. Talking they facts, the man. They went to parties. The crooks are here. The whistle they do. Hey, my nigga. Hey, my nigga. That, that shit was originated to protect the community. You know from that. who? What you mean that. from who? We had white gangs out there too, bro. What you mean? Well, Pol the you police? To all the people that telling the stories. Mm-mm-mm. That ain't, so that, that what, part ain't what, being what, told. What, 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 nigga, smack whack, man. Uh, smack well, whack. You, you got a slew of them. You go from Baba Louie to Monster Cody to... Uh, uh, Monster uh, Cody the can't tell that story. Well, Baba Louie, Kappa, you, you name them. Baba Louie told them. the story on, on my project. So, so that's what I'm saying. And, 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 and so I had him here in my home. It, it wasn't and he, it was never about to protect the community. It was because they had a fight at the high school. And he cracked right, it over up. Bro, listen. So that's what I'm saying. There's so many different where? stories. So well, all, I'm is, where, let, all I'm saying is, all I'm saying is, let's come up to today. Listen, the let's come to, all, all I'm saying is, all I'm saying is, see, y'all, y'all, see, y'all distracted. Y'all distracted. Y'all talking about 1969. Let's talk about Distracted from the truth, man. Well, I did bring it up. I'm just giving an example. whole, man. I keep saying, nigga, fuck how it originated to what I just said. Let's talk about what it's He's trying to bring the bullshit up. Let's talk about it. What is what is he protecting today? Nigga, whack is shallow. He's shallow as fuck. One hundred percent. Shallow ass nigga, nah, you man. Definitely can't stand on that. For what nigga, you shallow. On that? Cause you for fucking. Uh, you from I live. I, I live. I live there for almost two years. Yeah, but you from. Act like he know where. I, I live there. Nigga, and shallow. Man, nigga, make me sit. Diamonddale yeah. adolescent home. Why wouldn't I see it? I, I don't know what that place is. That nigga got a lot of blood on his hands, man. You googling it right now? It's when they it's when they come out of the way. Yeah, I, got this I go to Central. I go to Central. I go so to I, I, I lived on Imperial and Vermont in the heart of the Devil Lane Bloods neighborhood. I lived okay. on Imperial and Vermont, okay. and I walked That's them cool, streets bro. every day. So but you can't saying, tell me what I've seen. But the streets as a normal dude. Say, nah, homie. So, 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 so,
Wack got a lot of blood on his hand, and he ain't willing to face the truth. He just sold his soul, man. And he can't fa he don't want to face the truth. He's demonic. Look at his ass, bro. Like, like for real, man. Wack will kill you, bro. Like he, man, you can't trust a nigga like that, man. Wack will kill you. He he he's he's he he he's a snake. Look at him, bro. Back to the video. Normal dude, if I walked as a normal dude, how did I meet all these originals? You, bro, first of all, Baba Lou is what, 65 years old? I, I, didn't, I didn't meet Baba. I was introduced to Baba Lou from another original, from original crib. This man telling, trying to save the children. Okay, so. And this nigga okay, whack trying to justify game uh, activity, well, bro. Well, 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 you well, you well, I, well, I, I had. I, I had no reason to be this loud because I didn't yeah, have a problem. Be, like, okay, I, and listen, 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 homie, listen. If I live in California, like I'm from here, right if I was from California, and he trying, to be, he trying to be a bully, he trying to be a bully right now. So you telling me if you were if you I was from right California, now, let's hit the rain, nigga. California, like I'm from Texas, let's hit the rain, I'm whack, whack. So you answer the question. You the reason why a whole bunch of young niggas is dead. Looked over here at me, nigga. That's all I'm saying. I seen you in Paru Park, nigga. Me. And nigga, they got what they were looking for. With DJ yeah, K Slade. Y'all, y'all bullies. What you mean we bullies? Just that like bro. Dang. Man, whack. I seen you in the video with DJ K. I mean, well, yeah, DJ K Slade, man. Check it out. Whack 100, 100, DJ K Slade, man. Man, he, 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 he's very respected amongst the Paru organization. And yes, he he he's the reason why a lot of young black males are in the cemetery. So, uh, him him man, God will take care of all this, man, and he's taking care of it right now, man. God bless everybody, man. Let's get back to the video. Banging his bullying, fucking movie, and, and, and nigga gang banging his bullying, nigga. No, it ain't. No, it ain't. You trying to bully right now in the conversation? Ain't talking about nothing. Each other, the community, the people at the store, the bitches, brothers you fuck with, the houses you live in, the parks you lay in, the corners you sleep on, the corners you sleep on, nigga. Clown that nigga. No more, nigga. You with six nine, so I ain't talking to you, nigga. Stop personal. With six nine, nigga. What you mean? Snig on her. You can't bully. Snig on her with six nine, nigga. Snitch. You don't know what a snitch. No more, nigga. You up here with me in the industry, nigga. No, I'm yeah, listen, nah, you ain't even talking, nigga. Me, 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 you, you, me and you can do it some other time, nigga. You don't do nothing. You both know you don't. Say, say this, homie. Say, listen, listen, say, fam. All you listen, all you gotta do is pull my resume on the accomplishments out of dumb, nigga. I really do what you niggas talking about on here doing, nigga. Change the law. You both know, Charles, that Say, homie, do what I like with that. You know you got it. You know you hide over there in Fort Worth. I ain't hiding, homie. I just left the strip club where everybody see you. You hide in Fort Worth. You ain't Say, homie, hey, everybody take pictures with me. How they hide from me? Everybody take pictures with me. I did tell the Texans to do that. But you know you ain't in California saying this. Say, homie, listen, homie. California only bad in California. When you nigga leave outside of California, y'all get a good understanding. Y'all don't want to go. Y'all get a good understanding, nigga. Fuck <laughs> you, talking about nigga. That same church nigga bullies, man. Yeah, I still go to it, nigga. All right, all right. Yeah, yeah, I still, I'll be there tomorrow on Wednesday. Wednesday and right. Sunday, I don't miss. All right, went on the street. Yeah. Right? Do a personal pull up so trying to threaten the man. man. He's, a, no he's a whack ass, ass nigga. Man, I wish I was on that show. Nah, 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 black nah, people nah, still dying, black people still killing other black people. 
Uh, and you provoking provoke the nigga to want to kill him. Man, let me say this, man. I'm going to end this video. This nigga whack, man. Over probably, he probably 50 years old. Still, is still on the negative shit, man. Ain't trying to grow. And he, he, he's sitting there threatening a man for telling the truth. And then, first of all, I can't respect no man that's affiliated with a snitch, Takashi 6 9 So he's basically established. He's part of the establishment, man. He just sold his soul. And, and it's, to him, it's all about the money, man. So he's not willing to give up his persona, his character that he got, which is demonic. And he's 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 planting a lot of negative seeds, and he's the reason why a lot of young black men are in the cemetery, man. You know what I'm saying? So he does have a lot of blood on his hand. That's why he's a blood. And then on Pyro, man. Look, man. God bless y'all. Y'all have a blessed day, man. I wish I was on this on this on this stream, this live stream with them, man. Man, I'd have had a lot of things to say. Because, man, look, man, Charleston White, man, salute you, my brother, and keep body slamming these niggas, man. 100. Hey, what's that? Niggas dying. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That ain't what I do, man. That ain't what I do. So let's just keep yeah, the conversation we... constructive, man, respectfully to all parties involved, man. Let's just keep it. Man, that nigga can't tell nobody about no West Coast gang coach that he damn sure wasn't walking out here and being this loud. Nigga, you say, know man, damn say, well. Say, homie, listen. Say, listen. I, I got the pictures. How did I get in the Nipsey funeral with the Rolling 60s then? How? You how? Nobody, you nobody, 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 I was, how? 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 You was how? at the no, paper I, dinner. When, with, I rode in the car. I rode in the car, you nigga, with the you seat. in there talking shit? Fuck no. You was crickets. Nigga, go out there with a poor Nipsey out the casket. Don't look on that paper, paper. Yeah, yeah, it's all documented. Yeah. What you talking shit? Yeah, you, you talking shit, and ain't nothing no, happening to you. So what you think won't let happen to me, nigga? Why you, you ain't weaker than me, shit? nigga. Nipsey, you you ain't weaker than me, nigga. Ain't nothing happening to you. Hey, what? listen, you said some shit about Nipsey. It didn't nothing happen to you. No, I didn't. I talked about music. Right? I never was saying that about Oh, no, no. Stand on it, nigga. Okay, we'll go. Yeah, you said some disparaging remarks, nigga. Yeah, ain't nothing happened to you. Happen to you. So what makes go you think it's going to happen to me? Music, uh, I mean? ain't got to find it, nigga. You what? know what you said. Nipsey wasn't a legend music. Yeah, 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 yeah. You nigga, stop, nigga. Say, touch up. He said Nipsey wasn't a legend in music. Did me and what? He did say it. Whole ass nigga. You know damn well you wasn't in that field saying nothing reckless, my nigga. You know that. He trying, he trying to get, he trying to get Charleston White. He trying to get everybody to team up and kill Charleston White, man. That nigga's a snake, man. He's a snake, man. But uh, like I said, man, God bless y'all, and be productive and be and grow, man. You know what I'm saying? Just look, look for the truth. You can hear the truth. And what Charleston White is speaking on. You know what I'm saying? So, I don't know, man. I'm going in the video right here, man. God bless y'all. You have a blessed and prosperous day.